C'est fini. Fini between PSG and Mbappé. Stick a fork in it. They're not coming back from this. Impossible. Impossible, guys. What is happening since yesterday night? Big bomba announced everywhere. PSG excluding Mbappé from the Japanese tour. They are leaving him in Paris. They are selling him. El Khalifi made it clear. I am not losing you for free. You are leaving this season or you renew your contract. Mbappé, no intentions of renewing the contract. And so here we are, guys. Mbappé set to leave PSG. It was supposed to happen a season ago, two seasons ago. Why did you renew your contract if you knew you didn't want to stay there? I have no idea, but it's an ongoing saga. Uh, now we hear some teammates aren't happy with him. PSG is not happy with him. He is not happy with them not winning anything. Uh, La Ligue, uh, honestly, for him, he couldn't care less. He wants more trophy, bigger trophies. Maybe rightfully so. I don't know. But at this point, the big question is, who can buy Mbappé? at 200 million euros not a lot of team guys so right now we're talking Real Madrid Chelsea is very interested and Saudi Arabia teams of course they've been buying everybody and they have no money issues so if he decides to go to Chelsea Chelsea sold a lot of players made a lot of money back uh, Chelsea doesn't have money problems however Chelsea is not participating in the Champions League this season is he willing to go to Chelsea and do just the Premier League maybe he would be able to confront himself with the uh, best players in the world. They're almost all in the Premier League. And so uh, it would be an interesting challenge for him. But Chelsea last season was a disaster. So I don't know. Not sure. Of course, his dream is to go to Real Madrid. And Real Madrid is to have Mbappe. But I think Real Madrid wanted him for free next year at the end of his contract. Are they willing to spend 200 million euros this season? That's the big question. We all know Real Madrid doesn't have money problems either. So that is one of the teams that could possibly go for him and that he would love to go to. Of course, be, um, Real Madrid wins everything every year. So not a problem there. And the Saudi Arabian teams. Saudi Arabian teams, guys, they have money out of the yin yang. They don't care. They can buy anybody. We saw this uh, transfer market. All the players that are uh, in the older phase of their career all going there. And except for Milikin Visaj, who is like 27 or 28. Besides that, guys, is a 24, 25 year old, I don't know how old he is, 23, 22, whatever he is, willing to go to Saudi Arabia just for the money and say no to everything else? I don't know, guys. Like European competitions are the dream for most players, winning the Champions League, Le Ballon d'Or, everything else. I don't think if you go to Saudi Arabia, um, I don't know. For now, the league is not up there. Yes, there's a lot of older players. Whatever Ronaldo says, it doesn't matter. He can say whatever he wants. He can try and pretend that Saudi Arabia is better than the MLS and whatever else that he thinks, right? But honestly, for a very young player to just go there, yes, he's going to make a lot of money. They're going to give him money. More than he could even ever wish for, right? They're probably going to give him over 100 million euros a season. But is that what he wants at this point in his career? Without challenging himself, without playing against the best night in, night out, the Champions League nights? I don't know, guys. It's a big question. If he does accept Saudi Arabia, who can blame him? Who can blame somebody from her for accepting 120, 100, 150 million euros a year? Um, but at the same time, practically selling yourself just for the money so i don't know guys let me know what you think write the comments like and subscribe where do you think mbappe is going to go if he goes anywhere and if he stays in psg how bad it will that be this year let me know what you think write the comments like and subscribe